So here's a hidden feature that pretty much any mini PC and for that matter any PC out there has that very few people ever really seem to talk about. That's the fact that you could turn pretty much any computer out there into a 4K recording or streaming system. And I'm going to show you how to do that with these two things right here. That is a GMK Tech M5 mini PC and an AverMedia Live Gamer Ultra USB. USB capture card. Now the GMK Tech M5 is a relatively budget mini PC, but it's literally all we're going to need and it's already kind of overkill. You can pretty much do this with any kind of system out there that has been made in the last five years. But this serves as a perfect example of the type of PC that you could use for something like this. Now all of this is just as easy as plugging in the capture card that you're going to be using to the mini PC. See everything else is going to be handled in software so you actually don't need to do much of anything else in terms of the hardware. Just plug it in and everything should be set up to work perfectly fine. Now obviously on the streaming PC you are going to need to install OBS. You do that and you just go to the, your recording settings. And the key to all of this is pretty much in the video encoder. If you have an AMD based graphics system, go with the AMD hardware encoder. If you have an Intel system, go with QuickSync. And if you have an NVIDIA system, go with NVENC. The hardware accelerated encoding is literally the reason why this is viable on pretty much anything. For recording, I like to use the CQP setting and I set it to a level of 18. And with that, the recording quality ends up being pretty great here off of my laptop I was actually able to capture the alien isolation benchmark running and this is being captured at 4k 60 Hertz so this little system has more than enough power to do this and again this system is already pretty overkill you can do this with a hundred dollar Intel system as long as you have anything that has an Intel processor from 7th gen all the way up to 14th or if you're on the AMD side of things it's a little murky I can't 100% confirm this if this will work with Ryzen 3000 or 2000 series APUs but it will for sure work on 4000 5000 6000 and 7000 series APUs so practically any system on the market is going to work like this and while well, the benefit of a combo like this is the fact that you now have a very compact way of getting a dual streaming setup and the real benefit of a dual streaming setup is the fact that while you're playing a game if the game itself crashes it won't take down the stream with it sometimes it'll happen with these early access experimental games or sometimes even brand new AAA titles they'll have bugs that will end up leading to crashes that will lead to a blue screen screen and if you're streaming on the same system that you're gaming on that blue screen means that you now have a stream that has crashed so if you want to avoid scenarios like that a mini pc like this with a capture card is an easy way of doing a dual pc streaming setup so that any crashes or anything like that happening on your gaming pc won't affect your actual stream this is really just an extremely cost effective way of getting a setup like this up up and running and the fact that it's so small means that it doesn't take up a lot of space so having two computers isn't really a problem and these systems are extremely energy efficient while recording which would be the equivalent of streaming on this system pulling from the wall we were using 18 watts so really this is an incredible feature that pretty much any computer out there has that no one ever really seems to talk about